Hi, my name is Kim Morton. I am the proud principal of Temple Heights Elementary School in Vista, California. And I am here today just to tell you about our school and some plans that we have for the future. The vision of the Vista Unified School District is that we wanna be the model of educational excellence and innovation. And we know that if we wanna be that model, we're going to have to do some things differently than we have in the past. And we are proud to move along with our vision of being innovative in the way that we do things on campus. We currently have over 100 iPads on our campus at Temple Heights. The iPads are stored in carts, which allows us to charge them and sync them, and they are on a checkout system. We're moving from a checkout system where they're sporadically used to a one-to-one -one where it becomes part of the classroom, part of the learning environment, part of what the students are working with every day. And this is one strategy that I think has the potential to truly accelerate student learning. The students at Temple Heights are preparing for Common Core Standards, which our state has adopted. Common Core Standards talk about higher thinking skills, skills that students are going to need to have when they graduate from high school, skills that are going to get them ready to compete in our global economy. Some of the words that you'll hear in the Common Core Standards are words like create, analyze, synthesize, process, and these are all things that um, the iPad helps them do in the classroom. Uh, our mission is to inspire each and every student to persevere as a critical thinking individual who collaborates to solve real world problems. And we know that access to devices that enhance our connectivity, our ability to access information, uh, those are going to be powerful tools if we're truly going to live out that uh, purpose and that mission statement. You might find a fifth grade class researching a science topic and with the click of a button on the iPad they can access all of the resources that the internet provides. They can gather those resources, uh, synthesize the information, and create a project to share that information with their class. When they're doing this they are using all of the higher level skills. They're analyzing the information, they're doing a lot of reading, and they are bringing all of those resources together to create a project. Having iPads in my classroom has changed the way that I teach. They've allowed me to extend the teaching that's already going on and extend the learning. I think they've allowed me to do things that I wasn't able to do before and my students are more productive and they are learning more. So a lot of times when you hear about using iPads with, with children, you think, oh, there's fun apps, uh, there's fun games for the students to use on the iPad. Uh, but we're really trying to get away from the idea of the iPad being just a toy. We want to use the iPad in a bigger way than this. We want the students to use some of the powerful apps on the iPads that let them create projects, that let them bring in multimedia sources. A lot of the apps and the programs that we use on the iPad are going to be tools for learning. They're able to display their information that they gathered or they're able to collaborate with one another or create something new that they can um, you know maybe eventually post on the class website or share with other people beyond the classroom walls. And the reason this is important is this is a skill that they're going to need when they enter the, the world, the real world. Lots of jobs today require that students are um, competent in using technology. When you walk into a classroom where students are working on iPad projects, they are 100% engaged. The engagement of my students has gone way up by using and implementing iPads in the classroom. They are motivated to use the iPads and they find that the tasks that they're given on them tend to be more real to them and they seem to have a purpose. They can take it out into the garden and they can read a book. They can take it out into the hallway and create a video. It's very mobile, it's very easy to use, and it's very exciting and interesting for the students to use. All of the writing that they do is done on the iPads and then shared with me through Google Drive. So I can give them immediate feedback, real-time feedback for all of the writing that they're doing. Where in the past they would have to write and submit their writing to me and then I write comments on it and they give it back. But now as the students are sitting at their desks typing, I can be on my iPad and typing with them at the same time. And giving them comments and having chats with them while they're typing. So they're doing a lot of the traditional um, things that we did in school, like reading and writing, but they are so much more motivated and they are so engaged in their learning when they are 
finding their own information and creating their own projects. They are participating in traditional learning, but we're taking it to a different level to give them the skills that they're going to need to compete in our global society. So right now we, we borrow iPads to use in the classroom. It's not something we have every day. Um, so we're limited as to the projects we can create. So what we would like is to have iPads that are always in our classroom and um, let the device become more of a one-on-one -on -one, uh, tool for the students. So they have their own iPad and all their work is saved in one place. We believe that we are at the point where we now have a variety of learning resources that can ensure that students are safe and yet also have the ability to find an abundance of information that can truly drive their learning experience. Students at Temple Heights are so lucky. We have an awesome staff and we have a vision. And that vision is to use iPads in our classroom as a tool to help them engage in their learning, to be critical thinkers, to be problem solvers. Our teachers are always willing to try new things and they're always willing to be on the cutting edge of teaching and learning. So overall, I'm very excited about this initiative. I'm thrilled that Temple Heights is willing to be a leader and uh, to, uh, uh, to help us to be that model of educational excellence and innovation.